Hi, what's going on troops? Welcome to the ScareCorp Media channel. Today I would like to show you uh, how to uh, connect your Android device uh, to a serial uh, console cable for let's say a Juniper or a Cisco device. So some of the tools you'll need um, is your Android device then you will need your micro USB to a female USB converter. Okay, then you actually need your USB to serial converter. So that's uh, this guy here. And you will also uh, need, if, uh, if you have this, then you can use one of these Cisco provided um, uh, you know, 15 pin uh, serial to CAT5. These come with every Cisco device. Um, if you're working with Cisco's, you're, you're very familiar with these. They're pretty much everywhere. If you don't have one of these, or if uh, you want to be um, not uh, limited to the distance of the cable or, or whatever, uh, pick yourself up one of these and I use these all the time and these are so much cooler and so much better So basically they just hook up uh, you can get uh, different you know models and whatnot, but uh, They hook up to your serial device uh, Basically through the through this um, 15 pin and then they have a cat 5 out so then all you do is get any cat 5 cable and you know whether it's pre-made five six seven foot 20 foot 100 foot it doesn't really matter um, you know so you could be in the other side of um, uh, the server room and you can still be working on this so anyway um, <clears throat> get yourself a cat 5 and then plug it into the console uh, port on the back and that's your connection so let us uh, we'll connect. Okay, so we'll connect that. Put some of the stuff away. Then uh, you will connect your male to female USB. Okay, just like that. And then you will connect your Cat5 to the end of that, which goes. Pretty much to the back of the Cisco device here. <clears throat> and that's it for hardware, that's it for connections. Um, now you'll need your, to get yourself uh, uh, this program. It's called um, Slick USB to Serial. You can find it in the Play Store. Uh, they have a free version, which is what I have today, and they also have a 7 or $8 dollar paid version. Um, let's jump into that and see what that looks like. Alright, so pretty simple, um, you know, design. All the settings are pretty much all set for you. 9600 bit ray, parity none, data, uh, 8 bit, and stop is 1 bit. Um, if you want to uh, check the adapter info, so if I hit that, this will tell you that my... Um, uh, this USB cord actually is plugged into slash dev slash bus slash USB slash 001 slash 002. Um, so that's where uh, that's where this device is located. All right. So pretty much at this point, all you have to do is hit connect, and it'll tell you that it's. Um, uh, do you want to allow it to connect and we will say yes you could also get rid of that and so it doesn't um, you know prompt you for that okay so now at this point your cursors down here um, what I found with at least the free app it doesn't work on the um, on the side it only works uh, vertical not horizontal here so um, <clears throat> you know a little bit annoying but um, Anyway, so then you got this cursor down at the bottom. So you hit that little cursor, your keyboard should come up. And at this point, just hit enter a few times. And there we go. So I was already in here. Um, so let me just 
basically there you go so you have all your um, there so at this point you're already in uh, you just do some command so let's just do show run show space r u n okay so um, kind of squishes it all in here I bet you it'd look a lot nicer if this was a uh, um, landscape so there's our show run and there we go so if I hit spacebar tab like I would on a laptop or computer and then I can hide the keyboard and there you go so you can pretty much do uh, everything uh, you would be able to uh, on your uh, laptop or computer or whatnot so you also have the um, with the free version this doesn't work but you can also hit the save button and basically uh, like so you would type something in in here and you would like say show run or like a command and then you could save it so you don't have to type it out every time right um, so yeah you can you can basically fill this list up and that only works in the paid version um, and then you can change the color and there's you know get rid of the ads as well in the paid version but so uh, that's pretty much uh, that I mean it, it does work you can turn ports on ports off um, you know whatever you need to do so now let's take a look at see if we can make this thing work with the Juniper SRX device okay so I got it in here <clears throat> and let's go back into our cursor and hit the enter button there we go just like that we are in the SRX 100 so if I go uh, uh, show show and I hit enter oops case sensitive enter and there we go just like that so and you can see what's on here so very cool uh, you know it's quick on the go if you forgot your laptop or whatever you're, or you know you're out in the field you need to connect to this uh, serial console as long as you have this guy here uh, this guy here and you're uh, you're good to go so I keep this with me uh, you know and I have some at work as well so um, you know um, it's uh, it's very sweet and I do believe this program with the same setup will actually work on your Android tablets um, I have a Asus transformer and I haven't tried it yet but I've been uh, seeing that it, it, it should work uh, through those as well so um, and I do believe it'll work not just with the Cisco Juniper it'll work with anything similar that needs uh, you know with a similar config um, you know, so other devices that uh, that are basically the same kind of config, I'm sure they will uh, work as well. So, very cool. Um, uh, you know, this is uh, uh, kind of geeky, but uh, you know, it's um, if you work with this every day, um, you know, you'll uh, I'm sure you'll use it more than once. So, all right, I think uh, that's uh, it. If, um, for this video if you have any comments or questions or uh, uh, if uh, you found other cool applications for this uh, please post them down below I'd be very interested to see how uh, somebody else uh, uses this and if you like this uh, video please give me a thumbs up and uh, if you want to see more of these kind of videos please hit the subscribe button um, you will uh, be um, you know, notified as soon as uh, new videos come out, so that would uh, uh, be sweet. All right, I think that is it for my time. I thank you for yours. We'll